What's going on guys, Sanitary103 back in my kitchen and today's quick video I'm going to show you my version of a homemade chicken tofu noodle soup. This meal is a very very easy to make, it's highly nutritious, has high protein and very low carb. Uh, before I get started let me show you the ingredients that you're going to need. So uh, this is going to serve about two people, I just kind of eyeballed it. I just have about a cup's worth of like, carrots right here that I chopped up and then I have about two stalks of celery that I have chopped up here quarter of a white onion chopped up and then a couple of cloves of uh, minced garlic and then I have some chicken broth right here this is from Sprouts Organic I'll go into the exact portions once we get started cooking and then I got some uh, roasted chicken right here uh, some places already have the roasted chicken ready at the supermarket I had to ask the guy at the counter and he was nice enough to get it shredded for me if you don't have this option you can actually buy a rotisserie chicken at most local supermarkets and just cut it up so I got some chicken there and the star of this meal that makes this more interesting is right here this is a tofu a shirataki fettuccine noodles and the tofu uh, spaghetti shaped noodles if you just want to have chicken soup that's fine you can omit this but i definitely like to mix it up and for people that are a little bit curious about the amount of carbohydrates well this is not your average uh, like regular spaghetti this is made from tofu obviously and this one right here this spaghetti shaped noodle it only has 20 calories and two net carbs and this fettuccine uh, tofu uh, package has 40 calories and also two net carbs so you're looking at 60 calories total and only four net carbs so it's not much damage and also gives the meal a lot of good texture and flavor okay the first step you want to do is i basically turn on my oven on medium and I drizzle a little bit of olive oil in there it's already heated up and i'm gonna pour in the uh, garlic and the uh onion inside first want to do that until it gets soft just kind of move it around a little bit and this is uh, gonna take about a minute just let it get in there and get a little bit soft so after around two minutes or so you're gonna add the chicken broth this is about three to three and a half cups give or take of chicken broth just pour that in now I'm gonna add the remaining ingredients all the vegetables so here comes the celery Then the carrots, and now the chicken. Just gonna shred it up a little bit. And earlier I mentioned I added about three to three and a half cups of um, chicken broth, but based on the ratios, just kind of uh, you know play it by ear. Uh, if you look closely, it kind of looks like the broth is a little bit low, so I'll probably add a little bit more chicken stock. This is all dependent on how much fluid you want. So I may add a little bit more broth. It's up to you. So after you put the chicken in, you wanna put your stove on high and you wanna bring it to a boil. So after you put in the chicken, you wanna put your uh, stove on high, which I did, and it's bubbling now. Once you do that, you wanna cover it and you wanna reduce it to, I'm gonna go about a three, a low simmer for about 20 minutes. So once you do that, I'm going to show you uh, the next steps. I'll see you in about 20 minutes. Now that the 20 minutes is up, I'm going to show you the final step. It's very, very easy. So I got my uh, tofu uh, noodles. I took them out of the package. And you just want to strain it, okay? And you want to take out some of the excess liquid, which I did right here. And then I'm going to pour, uh, this is served for two people. I'm going to pour the noodles into a bowl. Now you could technically pour the uh, noodles into the big pot, but what might happen is that this tofu tends to stick in the big pot, so I don't wanna do that. Therefore, I'm putting it into the serving bowl right now. Now I'm gonna go over and pour the noodles on top. I wanna come closer. It's really, really hot, but I'm gonna do that. Oh, that looks really, really good. Look at that homemade chicken soup right there with some noodles on top. Let me get a little bit more liquid. Just a little bit more liquid. Look at that. And I'm going to top it off with a little bit of cilantro. Feel free to improvise that and then a little bit of crushed black pepper on top 
Look at that medley of flavors and colors right there. Homemade chicken tofu soup. This is uh, gonna be delicious. I'm gonna devour it. I hope you guys uh, really enjoyed uh, this recipe. This is packed with plenty of protein, like I mentioned. Low carbohydrate, you can have this in the winter time when it's nice and cool, or even in the summertime. There pretty much are no rules on my channel. Thanks once again for watching this video. If you have any comments or questions, be sure to leave them down below. Be sure to also check my other healthy recipes on my main channel. I'll put a playlist somewhere right here. And until then, I'll see you guys next time. Bye. This is just a roast beef sandwich already made. Now, technically, I can obviously make my own sandwich, but um, press for time. Gotta do what you gotta do, and this is a roast beef.